द अर्थ इन द सोलर सिस्टम क्लास सिक्स एम सीज विद एंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर वन वॉट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर वन हाउ इज द स्काय फील्ड विद आफ्टर सनसेट एंड इन द नाइट ऑप्शन ए ब्राइट ऑब्जेक्ट बी डीम ऑब्जेक्ट सी बोथ ए एंड बी डी नन ऑफ दिज करेक्ट एंसर इज सी बोथ ए एंड बी मीन्स ब्राइट ऑब्जेक्ट and dim objects is the sky filled with after sunset and in the night next question 2 what is the name given to the full moon night a amavasya b purnima c both a and b d none of these correct answer is b purnima question number 3 Which of the following name is given to the new moon? A. Purnima. B. Amavasya. C. A and B. D. None of these. Correct answer is Amavasya. Next question is fourth number. What are celestial bodies? A. The sun. B. The moon. C. All the shining bodies in the sky. D. All of these. Correct answer is all of these. Question number five. The celestial bodies which have their own heat and light are called a planets, b stars, c satellites, d. All of these. Correct answer is b stars. Question number six. Which is the most recognizable constellation? A. Saptarshi. B. Moon. C. The Sun. D. The Mars. Correct answer is A. The Saptarshi. Question number seven. The star which indicates the north is called A. Pole star. B. Pole. C. North pole. D. South pole. Correct answer is A. Pole star. the celestial bodies which do not have their own heat and light but are lit by the light of the stars are named as option a stars b planets c both a and b and d none of these correct answer is planets question number 9 the word planet has been derived from the word planet planet Tai, which is named as a Latin word, b German word, c Greek word, d English word. Correct answer is Greek word. Question number ten: Which celestial bodies form the solar system? A the sun, b the planets, c the satellites, asteroids and meteorites, and d all of the above. Correct answer is all of the above. Question number eleven. All the planets move around the sun in a fixed elliptical path. These paths are called axes. B. Orbit. C. Both A and B. D. None of these. Correct answer is B. Orbit. Question number twelve. Why is the shape of the Earth geoid? Option A. It is slightly flattened at the poles. B. It is a spheroid at the poles. C. Both A and B. D. None of these. Correct answer is it is slightly flattened at the poles. Question number thirteen. The Earth is called a unique planet due to a neither too hot nor too cold. B. Presence of air and water. C. Oxygen, light supporting gas. D. All of these. Correct answer is all of these. Question number fourteen: The Earth is called a blue planet because of the presence of a water, b blue color, c brown color, and d red color. Correct answer is a water. Question number fifteen: 
why do we see only one side of the moon from the earth a because of moon moving around the earth in 27 days b 27 days also taken in one spin c both a and b d none of this correct answer is c both a and b question number 16 why does the moon not have condition favorable for life a because of non-existent of water b because of non-existent of air c both a and b d none of these correct answer is c both a and b question number 17 apart from stars planets and satellites there are numerous bodies which also move around the sun what are these called option a stars b asteroids c meteorites d planets correct answer is meteorites question number 18 asteroids are found between the orbits of jupiter and option a mars b earth c venus and d neptune correct answer is a, a mars question number 19 meteorites are made up of option dust b pieces of rocks c gases and d none of these correct answer is pieces of rocks question number 20 what is called a cluster of millions of stars shining white in the starry sky option a stars b planets c milky way galaxy d satellites correct answer is c milky way galaxy question number 21 what makes the universe option a millions of galaxies b millions of stars c or d satellites correct answer is a, a millions of galaxies 